in figure two circles with center a and b touch externally at k find the length of pq so here if you take this p a this is the center p s is a tangent if you'll join a s the angle between radius and tangent is 90 so in triangle p s a in triangle p s a i'll apply pythagoras theorem triangle p s a so with the help of pythagoras theorem hypotenuse is p a square equals p s square plus s a square so p a is 13 13 square p s is 12 square plus s a square 13 square is 169 12 square 144 plus s a square so 169 minus 144 is s a square so s a square is 25 so s a value is under root 25 s a is 5 s a value is 5 centimeters so you got the value of s a which is 5 centimeters see if s a it is a radius so a k is also radius so this also will be 5 centimeters now in the same way if you'll join b t here angle is 90 because angle between radius and tangent is 90 now take this triangle b q t triangle b q t so b q is hypotenuse so hypotenuse square equals sum of the squares of other two sides b t square plus t q square so b q is 5 square b t square plus t q is 3 square so 25 equals b t square plus 9 25 minus 9 is b t square so b t square is 16 b t equals root 16 b t equals 4 centimeters so b t is 4 centimeters if b t is 4 which is radius of this circle k b also will be like 4 centimeters now we need to find p q i need to find p q so p q is nothing but p a plus a k plus k b plus b q so here if you substitute the values p a which is 13 centimeters a k 5 centimeters k b 4 centimeters and b q is 5 centimeters so here 13 plus 5 18 18 plus 4 22 22 plus 5 is 27 so the length of pq length of pq is 27 centimeters